Hi, this is Mike Maloney, and I wanted to talk about a Zero Hedge article that came out a few weeks ago, but I didn't comment on it earlier because it's not really that time-sensitive. It's just something that you want to ponder before April 15th, 2018 comes around. And the article is about uh, why, how the IRS is puzzled why out of 500,000 Coinbase users, half a million, only 900 reported gains or losses. Now, this uh, 500,000 number, that is a number from quite a while, while ago. It far exceeds that nowadays. But um, when you scroll down, you know, uh, the IRS dis detected a reporting gap between 500,000 virtual currency users on Coinbase uh, that were reported between 2013 and 2015, so that's a while ago, and the less than 900 Bitcoin users reporting gains or losses for each of those years. So this is old data. It's, it's much, much, much larger now, especially now that uh, it's becoming such a mania. Everybody is talking about it. Nobody was talking about Bitcoin back in 2013 and 2015. Only the hardcore Bitcoin people. A lot of people didn't even know what it was back then. But this is less than 0.2% of the Coinbase users bothering to report anything. So this is now adding up to many billions of dollars. And when the IRS sees that much that they can go after, they, they're going to put a very large budget behind this. And so if you want to play cat and mouse with the IRS, it'll serve you well to remember just who is the mouse. I mean, you have to think about this or it's going to cost you a lot in penalties and interest one day. And, uh, you know, <clears throat> this is one thing that will probably cause, you know, if you look at a Bitcoin chart, it's a stair step of a, a big, huge exponential runoff, uh, run up, a blow off top, and then a, uh, it bases for a while, and then it does it again. Well, the next blow off top and, and giant pullback that is probably going to happen, there's going to, it might not be the next one, but there will be one the day that the IRS. Uh, sends out bills to all of the people that did not report their profits on Bitcoin because it's going to include penalties and interest. <laughs> and <laughs> this is something that is potentially very, very large. And guess what they're going to have to sell to come up with the cash because you can't pay your taxes in Bitcoin. You have to pay them in dollars. And so the people that made profits and didn't report them when they get their bill for uh, the tax they owe, plus the penalties, plus the interest, it's going to be substantial. And they have to sell some assets to come up with those dollars. So it will cause another short-term top in the stair step that uh, Bitcoin does on its way up to wherever it's going. Thanks very much for listening. If you got anything from this, please subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you next time.